hey welcome everybody welcome to one more section of this course uh, as you can see we have created this uh, user I mean this main website for this project and after that we also created this administrator form uh, I mean the admin panel and here you can see our uh, database that has I mean six tables so far and we have worked a lot we have also uh, you know a uh, customer user interface for customers so that's all done now we need to work on the I mean the payment gateway for this project if someone actually adds a product to cart and uh, after that they want to order that uh, product so we uh, can have a payment method for them so they can pay us online and then we can send them uh, the, the, the product they have ordered they have purchased so it may be either a uh, digital product or maybe physical product in this case in our website case we have these all products uh, which are physical products basically these are not uh, digital products so we will use a payment method and we will use will process orders and we'll get uh, the order details from the customers including the transaction the payment uh, details and we'll save them inside uh, uh, you know d different tables inside our database and you can use the same uh, method for digital products or for anything you can you want to sell online uh, so you can use that this proce uh, process for any kind of your project that you have created in PHP or any other web development tool so the PayPal uh, integration is not uh, difficult uh, but uh, should be done very carefully so if we want to include PayPal as a gateway uh, as a payment gateway in our project so first of all we must have a PayPal account with their business account or personal account but with, with business account you have more uh, options more advantages you can use more tools and you can uh, have a great experience but personal account is also able uh, to receive payments from users so you will have to go to paypal.com and you will have to create your account there very simple procedure is that just click sign up and create your account uh, you know it is asking you to create individual account or business account uh, you know or business account you need to have a you know a business registration I mean your business must be registered in order to create this account because they may ask you for details but you can simply create individual account which is also eligible for sale online you can see it is written for sale on uh, online and for receiving payments basically so uh, you need to just get started this one and after that you will be taken to another page where you can simply uh, put your details and can create this account so that's really simple procedure same like you create an account on Facebook after you have created your account then uh, you need to simply go uh, to write developers developer.paypal.com this is uh, you need to actually put this address in the address bar and after that click so you will be here on this page basically in order to uh, integrate PayPal into our web applications we first uh, we first need to actually test that method if that works fine and everything is okay without any uh, I mean without any errors or without any problem so then we can uh, make that payment a method or that thing online similarly like we are working on this project we have worked on this project on localhost you can see so we may, when we will uh, understand and we will see that everything is fine code is working all the uh, features and all the applications are working perfectly so after that we will upload this whole project to online web server and this will be then available to all the people from around the world but before that we need to actually make it secure and make it perfect and there should not be an error because uh, on online server that will be a very big shame for uh, for every developer if there is uh, error in the code so similarly like that when we integrate the PayPal uh, system or PayPal payment uh, uh, process to our applications we first test it when it is working fine 
uh, in the testing mode after that we use the real way or the actual way of PayPal so that is very very uh, similar way I mean the testing uh, environment is very similar to the real one you just need to uh, then change the URL of the payment you know the re you need to add the real URL instead of the testing URL that is a little bit difference between them and uh, all the other things are uh, works work uh, the same I mean fine so this is pay, uh, PayPal developer mode so here uh, if you have a PayPal uh, account you can just log in to this PayPal developer uh, environment by using this option I mean login so here you can use uh, the testing environment of PayPal I mean you can test receiving and sending money using test PayPal accounts that is called sandbox PayPal uh, account which you can create and very simple you can use them uh, I mean to test whether it's working or not and after that it will be working for real as well so very simply we will just uh, log into this developer uh, PayPal developer by using this login we'll click it and we'll put my detail after login I can tell you what to do next I'll put my email and password here you have to give your real PayPal email address and your real PayPal password so after log after uh, login we can then uh, create test accounts so we can use them separately so just I will say login I'll click login and after that I will be logged in basically now the page has refreshed or you can see here this is my name Abdul Wali so I am logged in after logged in to this uh, PayPal developer you can simply you need to go to application you can see over here this is application or you can click dashboard so just click dashboard and after you came to dashboard here you can click application and when you click the application you can just uh, observe at uh, left side there is written sandbox accounts so sandbox accounts are basically those accounts test accounts which you can use as a test to receive money to send money and you can create uh, you know many accounts as uh, test accounts using this sandbox uh, application here inside PayPal developer so we will also create some test accounts and we'll test the payment uh, PayPal payment method for all this website that we have created so people can pay us and after we test it then we can just simply change the main URL and our main uh, or uh, test email to the original email the real email uh, and the test URL to the real URL of PayPal so that will work the same way then and one one thing more we can also add uh, dollars and or any other currency as much as we want to the test accounts so we can test them so you need to just click sandbox accounts and I don't have any account here this is my email just uh, I know this is my email that I use to log into uh, PayPal so I can create uh, accounts here so I will create two accounts one business and one personal the business account I will use to receive money inside and the personal account I will use to I mean uh, to buy things or to to buy products because I have this project okay so as I am teaching you this course so I will need to have two accounts because uh, because uh, uh, from one account I will buy this thing and in another account I should receive that money so I will show you how you can uh, easily you know buy a thing and how you can then receive that money inside your business account so we need to actually simply uh, create two accounts or here one will be a personal account and one will be, will, will be business account you can see this button over here create account and make sure you are logged into the uh, PayPal developer so then you can create accounts and you can use this whole development environment just click create an account it will take you to uh, this page create account and here you can select a country which is by default United States and that's okay an account type personal 
uh, and you can observe it is written here buyer account and merchant account so business account means merchant account and personal account means buyer personal means we can buy things and business means we will receive payments so I will first of all create a business account I will uh, just check this radio button and after that you can create a virtual email just a temporary email for this so I will just simply say business business test at uh, shop.com this is just you know this email does not exist but I'm just creating for testing so business test at shop.com and its password will be very simply Wally and sorry password must be uh, eight characters so I will add Wally Khan that's it Wally Khan sorry password is Wally Khan and first name last name Abdul Wali and we can add PayPal balance we can add uh, I mean uh, dollars to it currency to it so that is up to you how much you want to add this is basically test money so it will be uh, appearing in your account so I will add 5000 uh, I mean 5000 dollars because this is free so I can add as much as I want that's it now there is no need to do anything just click create account because this uh, all the information are just test information and you can see you you just created a new test account it is saying here the message and this is my business test at shop.com country US business type one more I need to create just I will click again the create account option and I will this time uh, select this personal account and we'll give it an email which will also be a test email just personal test at shop.com that's it another password will also be Wali Khan and this is my name and I will add thousand dollars to it so thousand dollars to it because this is my business account and it will have a balance of thousand dollars which is basically a test thing create an account I will click and it will create the personal account as well now you can see personal test at shop.com uh, uh, and you just created a new test account so I have two accounts now uh, personal test at shop.com and business test at shop.com and passwords for both of the accounts are Wali Khan so now we can go to the real testing account I mean real test PayPal account so here you can uh, observe enter sandbox side because you have created the accounts I mean email addresses and other information you have given but now if you want to access uh, uh, if you want to go to that website this is here enter sandbox side just I will click it and inside a new tab you can observe here in the browser www.sandbox.paypal.com this is basically uh, the testing environment so now I can log in with the test accounts here into this site not with my real uh, email of PayPal but with uh, this test account so I will just simply uh, first of all open this business test so I can see how uh, the thousand dollar it has or not business test at shop.com so very simply I will put this email there and the password is uh, Wali Khan very simply I will click login so I will be logged into this account so that we can see or uh, I mean we added one thousand dollars to this account so we must have one thousand in this that is a test money basically so the more money we receive the more we will have inside this account and you can see five thousand oh my god sorry we added five thousand dollars to that uh, I mean this business test account that was a mistake but uh, okay no problem so we added 5000 to this business test at shop.com and 1000 to this personal test I just uh, misfigured that thing okay doesn't matter this is uh, this looks like you know real PayPal account so you can see just because this is a test account you can see this is written test site and at bottom you can also find test site 
but looks like real account we you can send money you can receive money and things like that and we will see transactions that we will have if someone buys something from all this i mean this shop so we can receive that money inside this business account and we can similarly like that log into this uh, personal test as well where we will have thousand dollars and using this personal test account i mean personal test at shop.com which is the email for that uh, personal account we can use this to buy things from this shop or from any shop in the world uh, so we will receive that money in into this business account that's it and next video i'm coming back and we'll just take that paypal code to uh, integrate into our application so after that we can uh, buy things or these products using paypal stay tuned